वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो टुडे वी आर मेकिंग वाइट रेडिश पराठा ऑन मर्चेंट शिप वेन यू आर सेलिंग विद इंटरनेशनल क्रू समाइम यू मिस द टेस्ट ऑफ द होम सो समाइम ऑन संडेज वेन वी गेट टाइम वी ट्राई टू प्रिपेयर समथिंग फॉर आर सेल्फ टू प्लीज आर टेस्ट वर्ड ऑन दी अदर हैंड आर शेफ इज मेकिंग बिरयानी यूजली ऑन द संडेज ही इज मेकिंग इट फॉर द इंडियन क्रू एंड यू कैन सी इट्स लुक्स प्रिटी डिलीशियस टू मी द फ्लेवर्स आर देयर and uh, this is one of the most loved uh, food by the indian crew on board so we took the fresh radish and then we gonna grate it in small pieces as you can see so that it's uh, finely you know mixed with the flour that we will add and uh, it won't take much time uh, if prepared in a right way so now it's time to add some spices uh, to the taste we'll add some red chili powder little bit so now we have added a uh, red chili powder as per our need you see this is papadam this is also quite good uh, food item which goes very well with the uh, biryani or something delicious we'll have a look at the la later on So now we have added salt and little bit of uh, garam masala. Chief officer Amit is preparing this dish. Then we'll add some little bit of coriander powder. Actually, you can add uh, spices as per your need, as what you like. There is no hard and fast rule. The basic spices still remains the same, so you can add as per your need. we are making it little bit mild so that uh, other people can also eat it i mean the international crew so now the next step will be to mix all these spices nicely in this white radish on the other hand let's see what uh, the steward is doing oh he is preparing the custard not the custard sorry this is like a curd indian curd which goes very well with the biryani Uh, in india we call it uh, raita and uh, it has its own variants plenty of kinds so now let's take it to the other place and uh, add some flour as the consistency i mean thickness of this whole uh, mixture should be like that it doesn't stick to your hand so we'll add little bit more flour also as per the need So this flour is little bit different from the flour that you use for bread. This is little bit different in composition. So we have to thoroughly mix this one with all the ingredient that we added just now. It will take let's say 10 minutes just to mix it very well. Okay, you see the papadam this is how they they are cooked. you can deep fry them in oil as the cook is doing or you can even put in the microwave without any oil or little bit of brush of the oil and they will taste good so it depends how you like it so now our flour is ready with the white radish inside and all spices now it's time to actually make them in flat bread this is the chicken biryani that the chef just prepared he's adding now chicken into it in india there are different ways of to make this one and uh, people have their own way to make it he didn't he even added eggs into it some people like it okay now we have to roll these uh, mixture of white radish and flour and spices into flat breads after flattening these breads uh, we have to cook them on a pan it can be flat pan like completely flat or like just like a sauce pan as as well i mean it depends what you have on the ship available so without uh, ghee first you put the flat bread and let it cook on one side and once that side is cooked you little bit like a gold then light gold brown then you flip it over and on that side you put apply some ghee or 
uh, even you can use uh, refined oil or can, or you can apply canola oil i mean people have their own way of uh, applying the oil some prefer butter some prefer even olive oil as well so you have to wait just 5 minutes and flip it over until it's a uh, dark little bit dark uh, brown on the outer side in the meantime you can roll more uh, flat bread so you maintain the speed usually it's very difficult to get the circular shape okay now you can see this second one is cooking and uh, the first one is here you can see that's how it should be so now we will fill it up, flip it over to the other side and then we have to apply a ghee on this side which is how partially cooked you can sprinkle some flour while rolling it so that it prevents it from getting stick to the surfaces and it easy to turn around as you can see so now this is how the final product looks like you can eat with the curry you can eat with the indian yogurt whatever you like thanks for watching this video